I've been looking for these kind of programs for uh, quite a while now and uh, did a bit of research in them and uh, just lo and behold I googled it and it up, uh, up it came and uh, I looked at it, looked into the detail of it and I said that's the one. I first heard about the sustainable business program because I got a mailing because I'm finishing up my master's in public administration. I had just gotten done with a really intense class, um, an environmental studies class focused on sustainability. And coming out of that class, as a business student, I really felt like I needed more. Uh, I first heard about the course um, by seeing posters all around campus. And uh, I, I was planning on taking summer classes anyway. And I was really interested in sustainability and business also. So I felt like it was almost a perfect fit for me. So um, after I looked at the posters, I went online to the registrar's website, looked at the description, the timing, and uh, it just seemed like it'd be a great class. So I signed up for it. I wanted to take this kind of a course because uh... I'm at a point in my life where I wanted to change. I wanted to reinvent myself and uh, find a new path. I thought it was an interesting mix um, to come from my public and governmental background and learn, take a business class that learned more about how for-profit companies are incorporating sustainable practices in their work. My major is mechanical engineering. Um, I'm going to be a senior here at uh, UVM. I've been a, a teacher for uh, quite a while now and. Uh, on actually sustainability and environmental issues and uh, after having taught it for a number of years to, to younger students I thought why not take that knowledge out into the bigger world. My interest in sustainability um, actually doesn't come from an environmental background at all. Um, in fact it was very funny to a lot of people that I was taking a class like this because my interest is much more um, along social justice and social responsibility. Something we don't study in mechanical engineering is the social responsibility side of it, of, sustain, uh, of sustainability and you know the business side of it and I, I took the class so I could sort of bridge that gap. Sustainability in Vermont, I think there's a lot of opportunities. It, it feels to me like all the ingredients are in Vermont to create a real sustainable movement. Um, there clearly is an environmental focus in this state. We're small enough that I'm convinced we can do just about anything we put our minds to. Our legislature and governor are extremely accessible to the public at large, and so I think those are good ingredients to really pushing this effort in the state. There's a lot of really amazing businesses in Vermont that have been leading their business with their values and they're very profitable businesses. Seven generations come to mind, Ben and Jerry's comes to my mind, uh, the Green Mountain Coffee Roast Company comes to mind. They're all great businesses that are uh, uh, beacons in this whole initiative. So when I saw this university offering the course with those companies to draw from, I thought this is definitely going to be worthwhile. The week-long intensive was just that. It, it was pretty intense. Um, I have a young daughter who's about two years old, and so it was a commitment to juggle daycare and all that, but it was definitely worth it. I thought that the long days were well done. Um, they had a lot of different professors talking with us. Um, the Bringing in the business leaders was definitely nice to break up the day and sprinkle in some practical knowledge with the academic knowledge. It almost adds the dynamic of the course by having it five days. I don't think it would be the same course if you had it over a semester long or even half a semester. My words of wisdom for sustainable business are probably to get some rest before the class starts and be prepared for a week of intense information but a very important piece um, and really just enhancing your education and learning a lot more about where we need to go with our future to save this planet. There was never any point in which we didn't have anything to do. There was never a point in which I felt like I needed a break that I wasn't getting. And it really was a great class to fit in a five day period because it allowed us to have uh, speakers come in and talk to us and really get involved with us and really, you know, reach us in a way that you can't be reached when you're only have a, have a speaker come for 45 minutes or even an hour and a half. It was nice also to get some networking time with uh, having our meals as a class was kind of neat because it gave us time, some downtime to get to know different people's backgrounds and why they were taking the class, which was very informative. There were people, business people in the local community, business people from all around the United States really, who were coming here 
uh, to learn about what sustainable business is and how business dynamics are changing in our world and how we need to be up to speed with how things are changing and what we can do to make a difference. The best part of the program for me would have been, uh, I think, the, the meeting people, both with my, my colleagues within the program, meeting and exchanging ideas with them, because that's why I came. I'm a fish out of water in business and, and things like that, and so I wanted to meet business people and uh, see if I was a fit. We went to Ben and Jerry's at first, and. It was, you know, I've never been there before, and being in Vermont, you know, you say, well, you haven't been to Van Jerry's, but uh, it was it was so great, and it was just one of their administrative office buildings, and it was, like, you know, amazing just to see how, you know, and I'm, I'm talking sustainability here and social responsibility, but how social responsible they really are. The first day of sustainable business, we talked about um, the concept of ecology and economics merging, because current economic theories don't take into account waste or natural resources. And so looking at economics in a whole new way to, to take into consideration those two